may not believe this, but our friends are broke again. I believe it. I believe it. And how did it happen? It's a long story. We've got four minutes left. Well, it all began when Uncle Waldo started the Wigglesworth Wisconsin Pickle Company. They bought up every cucumber and gherkin for miles around. Got a thousand gallons of pickle juice. And 500 pickle barrels. And then it started to snow. Froze every cucumber in Wisconsin. The, the gherkins, too. I'm wiped out. Yeah, what's more, we're stuck with all these barrels and pickle juice. Hmm, maybe we could look in the paper and find a job. A job? Give me that paper, Hoppity, before your young, impressionable mind is warped beyond... St. Adonis, Agnes McGee, look at this. Say, hey, what is it, Waldo? Just the chance of a lifetime for our little Hoppity is all of here. The famous Angels Camp Jumping Frog Contest. The fame, fortune, and a lot of prizes. Hoppity, you are about to become a contestant in the greatest sporting event in all frogdom. The Angels Camp Jumping Contest. Yeah, but Waldo, Angels Camp is in California. And we're in Wisconsin. And never the twain shall meet. Yeah, we can't afford to meet the twain. We're close. If I could just sell these barrels, we could. Uh-oh. I'll uh oh, oh later. Right now, I'd rather eat. No, Fillmore, I've got it. Uh, a light bulb? No, an idea. Fillmore, can you bust one of these barrels? Uh, like this? Yes. Now, I tie two barrel staves to my feet, and voila, instant skis. Skis? Aren't they a little small? They're, they're compact skis for skiing on little hills. Oh, boy. And so the next day... All right, folks, step right up and get your compact skis, the latest novelty in winter sports. Uh, how much are they? They're absolutely free. They're free? Waldo, have you flipped your fedora? Free? I'll take a pair. I'll take two pairs. I'll take a dozen. Within a few minutes, all the compact skis had been given away, and the eager citizens were trying them out. Whoop! In a short time, most of the citizens of Foggy Bog, Wisconsin, were full of aches, pains, bruises, and sprains. Quickly, chaps, fill these bottles with pickle juice. Oh. Oh! Uh, what seems to be the trouble, my good man? I sprained my back. Oh, you are in luck. Here is a bottle of Wigglesworth ski liniment, good for man or beast, only a dollar. Smells like pickle juice. It is pickle juice. Tell me, did you ever see a pickle with a sprained back? Well, no. There you are, then. I'll take it. Me, too. And me. At the end of the day, Waldo had sold enough pickle juice liniment to finance their trip to the West Coast. But I just thought, now we have money, we don't have to go. Yeah, yes, we do, Hoppity. Look there. You know, suddenly I feel the call of the open road. And once more, Waldo bounced over the county line just ahead of the sheriff. Away our friends went across the country, and in a few days were approaching the California border. Little did they know that a reception committee was already waiting for them. Yep, they got a frog with them, Buckshot. Okay, boys, run out the sign. Hey, look, Uncle Waldo. California welcomes jumping frog contestants. A shortcut to Angel's Camp this way. Hey, that's real funny. Look, they're waving at us. <laughs> How friendly. Uh huh? But where how come they're waving with their fists closed? It's a real California welcome, Hoppity. I've read about it many times. Hoppity was right to wonder, though. For just around the next curve, that shortcut ended in a hundred-foot drop to a dry stream bed a bed already littered with the remains of other unfortunate contestants. What's this all about? We'll find out next time in Hoppity's Dead End or Canyon Fodder. <laughs>